what's up you guys it's kaylee welcome back to another vlog and yes you guys i dyed my hair dark brown i'm feeling it i feel like a whole new vibe honestly in my opinion i feel like different hair colors like bring out like a different side of me i, I don't know probably is it like i'm still the same person but does anybody feel that way when you change like your hair color it's just, like like where are we trying to go with this <laughs> um dark hair i feel like brings out like the baddie side of me like like that's all i can say i don't know how else to put it and then when i have like pink hair i'm like super baddie and then when i'm like my um like balayage i'm like the cutesy like girly girl which i am a girly girl but i don't know anyways let's stop talking about hair for today's video we are going to be going to tj maxx and we're going to be decorating for fall i usually just don't decorate last year i kind of got in a festive mood and decorated for christmas and so this year i'm in a festive mood and i'm like fall like i'm actually really excited for fall hence like why i dyed my hair and um all that also yes i did this myself so obviously it's not gonna be perfect i let me show you guys what i use because honestly it was amazing um i was watching like a bunch of different like um youtube videos of different products to use and let me see um, like I was saying, I was watching a bunch of different videos of like how to dye my hair like darker brown because in a future video we are going to be trying on like wigs and stuff and I wanted it to match. I, I knew I was going to be, um, that I wanted to be brunette so like I matched the wigs or the pony extensions and stuff and etc. Um, to brown hair and then I realized that like I was trying to find a hairstylist and I didn't like any of them. I did have one girl who did like my balayage and she was pretty cool, but I also didn't want to spend the money. <laughs> so I was like, how can I save some money and dye my own hair without potentially like ruining it? And so we didn't need like a Brad Mondo like situation going on here. So um, I got this um, Moroccan oil color depositing mask and the color cocoa, or is it cocoa? I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, this is what I used. It's a temporary color deep conditioning treatment. It literally made my hair so soft. But um, it's not, this video is literally not about my hair, but I'm just like, I love it. It's so cute. I think I like freaking did a good job. Like, hey. Which honestly, how could I mess it up? It's literally, you just put it in your hair, like wait 10 minutes, or actually it says five to seven. But the video that I watched was like a 10, like, she's like, I don't do it for 10 minutes. So I was like, okay, me too. And yeah, this is what we got. <laughs> Anyways, let me know if you guys like it. Um, should it be a permanent thing for a while? Because I kind of miss my dark hair. It's literally been two years since I've had dark hair and I, ah, I love it. And I love that, like, because it's balayage, of course, like, the browns will take differently. So it gives it still, like, dimension. Okay, anyways, let's go to the purpose of today's video, which is going to be um, going to TJ Maxx. And I think we might hit up some thrift stores too. I don't know. We're gonna hit up some stores and we're gonna find some fall decor. Hold on, let me check my phone. Okay. And Julia is actually coming with us. Yay! We love friends. <laughs> and so we are gonna try to uh, decorate my house for fall. Nothing too extravagant, just something a little here and there so it can be a little festive. I feel like lately I've been um, going through something like, I don't even know, like anxiety. If you guys don't know, I have really bad anxiety. It's very like social anxiety as well as um, environmental I would say and it's very gloomy um, today in um, LA it's actually supposed to thunderstorm today and tomorrow and I actually was supposed to go on a trip this week but then something happened with uh, I was actually gonna be a bachelorette party something happened um, health wise everything's okay though um, so I had to cancel that so I was like dang like I was looking forward to going and uh, yeah, so to make myself feel a little bit better, we're gonna hang out with uh, Julia. I love her so much. And then we are also, why does it keep on focusing? It's because I move my hands. Um, and then we're gonna do some shopping, which um, does not go very well with my bank account, but it makes me feel better. So <laughs> basically, yeah, I'm gonna go spend my money because it makes me a little bit happy in the moment to, you know. And I think that if I make my house a little more festive, I feel better. Yeah, does that make sense? <laughs> um, so that's kind of the plans for today. I got like a mini workout in this morning, but it wasn't like the best workout, but I'm just I'm trying to think positive. And I'm like, at least we did something rather than nothing because yesterday I didn't work out because I was like very 
not happy and I don't like to use the word depressed because I feel like people use that like all the time and that's like a very serious thing and I don't think I'm depressed I think it's just like my anxiety that like triggers my emotions so yeah <laughs> we're getting deep today but like I'm actually in a pretty good mood I had an Alani <laughs> and so uh, yeah let's go spend some money I'm just waiting for Julia to get here and so let me just show you my fit and then once Julia's here we are gonna head out all right so here's the fit it's just like this top I got from Nasty Gal um and then I got my shades on that I probably won't be wearing because it's super gloomy but I just think that it goes with the outfit so it's gonna be an accessory um and then some like super baggy pants um from garage oh the abs are popping in this lighting anyways um and i can't really decide for shoe wise i think i was gonna go with these um i think they'll look really cute um we don't wear shoes in the house though yo but i think see okay that's a vibe but but yesterday i went to target um just to walk around and get out of the house and stuff and i went with christian and i got these shoes okay let me get the other one so you guys can see it and i was like very tempted to wear them today because i just love them but it does not go with the fit and okay i put a poll up on my instagram if you want to be part of my polls follow me on instagram <laughs> and i was like like cute stylish shoes or like pilgrim shoes and like christian hated them but i loved them i was like i have a vision for outfits like i was like pull them up on pinterest i was like trust me they're cute like they're gonna be it for this like fall <laughs> so comment below if you guys like them or not um like i said these don't go with the fit but like <laughs> i just want to show you guys they're cute like obviously you can't really see them because my pants are so baggy hence why they don't go with the fit but like come on they're fire mini skirt with like long socks and like a crop top or something and a blazer oh my god it'll be so cute actually you know what they're they're not too bad with the fit but i'm not gonna wear them <laughs> Okay, um, I need, like, your opinions. You know what, I guess, why do I always ask for your opinions? Like, I love your opinions, but it's not gonna help me at the moment. Anyways, you know what, I'm trying to get, like, a bag. And I don't like a big bag today, but this is the only big purse that I have. Unless I use, like, a tote bag. Ooh, I might use a tote bag. Hold on. Alright, I'm back. I have the tote bag. This is, like, it says California West Coast in black. And I think this could be cute. Ooh, like, cash, very cash, okay. Um, or we could do this purse, which, um, I don't ever get rid of anything because I've had this purse since, like, sophomore year of high school, and it's, it's been way too long. I'm not even going to get into how long I've been out of high school. Anyways, <laughs> we could do this bag, but I feel like it's too dressy up. It doesn't really match with the vibe. I'm trying to go very neutral tone, like, black, black, white, um, yeah, I don't know. I just need, like, a big bag because it's going to be raining, and although it's going to be super hot, I think it's going to be, like, 90-something, but raining... Um, I still want to bring a jacket to like cover up even though I'm already sweating in this um, And I also want to make sure my camera can go in the bag if it does start to rain So we need to go with a big bag not a small black purse, which at first I was gonna do that. So one Or two This one actually is better. I wish I did have these. Okay, let's go <laughs> Okay, so we guys so, so what? <laughs> what are we saying? Okay, so we are at TJ Maxx and I'm getting nervous vlogging in public. So we're using my phone so it's not as like obvious what's happening. I don't want to get kicked out either. Um, but look, they have no pool there. I don't know what this is, but I love the cream shop. They have the cutest little packaging and their stuff is great. I think like it says go bananas. Like, let me just show you guys. Look how cute this is. Ah! Anyways, we were here for Halloween decor fall decor whatever you want to call it and why am i looking in the makeup julia got a purse though and it's so cute and i kind of want it but they don't have it in black so <laughs> julia what you got there i guess this is so sad this makeup used to be like 80 dollars and then it it's because it's yeah like yeah <laughs> bye so nobody yes. wants that okay so honestly i don't even know what i want but i found some like this is halloween fall decor um do i need soap you always need soap, right? Yeah. <laughs> so maybe I'll get some soap and some makeup wipes to <laughs> decorate my house with makeup wipes. A little pumpkin. You know, for our drunk occasions where there's, you'll find them anywhere. Um, I don't know. We'll see what I, I don't know. Maybe we'll get like, um, what are they called? Like fall blankets and like little table stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna look around. You guys, they have 
um, Halloween socks. And if you don't know, I'm freaking obsessed with socks. Like, I love fun socks. And, and I can literally get socks and match with Spencer. Look, we could be matching. I don't even know if he'll like socks, but um, he doesn't like shoes. <laughs> Very tempted onto buying that. We'll see if I get it. I probably won't, but <laughs> I want it so bad. <laughs> All right, so failed attempt on trying to get Halloween PJs because they only had like larges and like one pair for like small, but that's okay. We are just speed decorating my house, not myself, so. <laughs> we could just take a browse with the shoes. I think it's. Wait, are those socks or shoes? These are weird. I don't like these. But these are actually kind of cool. Hmm. What kind of shoes do I need? Julia, what do you need? <laughs> Okay, well, boots. Here we go. <laughs> I think I need more like going out heels that are like short because all my friends, all my friends are short and I don't want to be a giraffe. So, yeah. Oh wait, these are cute. Nice. <gasps> Ooh, what about these? I like those. I used to. They got too small. Is it fire? Just kind of remind me of two They do look like them. <gasps> Fuzzy slippers? <laughs> it's like, it's <laughs> 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 yeah, I found the best section. The dog toys! And there's pillows back here too. Okay. Should I get Spencer a toy? He's been a good boy, but like, he just got a toy yesterday. I'm gonna get him. Let's see. Dude, should I get him this like a really big <laughs> what is this? Um Papacino Jack o' Lantern one. I think it's so cute, but he's literally like the same size as this. Okay, that's kind of exaggerating, but it's pretty big. I'm gonna see if I can find like a small toy because he really likes oh wait, like a little pumpkin. He likes small squeaks. Oh gosh. I don't know, it's gonna squeak. He likes really small toys. Um he likes to like chew them, so maybe I'll get him this. It's the prize him. <laughs> Hello you guys. It has been a couple of days now since I went shopping at TJ Maxx and like literally after that it started raining and I was just like I'm not feeling like setting up the house anymore. My house is a mess anyways. It's still kind of a mess so excuse that. But um, today's the day that I'm going to show you guys um, what I got. I'm going to decorate the house for fall. I'm like kind of excited. Um, I think... I usually am not festive, but this year I am. I think the little things just like make me happy these days. So yeah. Also, here's the fit today. We are feeling a little <sighs> upset, a little down, but we added like some colors. I got ready guys. Like I put my makeup on. I went outside, got some sun. This shirt says have more fun because life is short so don't forget to just be happy and have more fun and it's like super colorful and cute and i'm wearing like blue shorts from uh bow and tee and i believe this shirt is from i actually don't know where this shirt is from cotton on maybe anyways let's just get to the decor um let's go <laughs> okay so i kept myself at a budget of like a hundred dollars um for this like first round of shopping but i feel like i still need to get a few more items for the stuff that i got um so yeah but i think what we have for this little like haul will be enough and then just like a little bit of here and there to like finish the little touches to the house but, but this is what we have like this bag this bag and then this and yeah so let me show you what i got <laughs> okay so in this little bag um I got this cute little truck like are you kidding me so like if you guys don't know like the vibe of my house is like very like modern slash like the house is modern but like the style that I really like is like farmhouse vibes like very warm and like cozy and like very like neutral tones and then like my bedroom is very like boho vibes but I still try to touch like a uh, tie in the like modern-esque you know, because like, the house is modern, you can't just like make everything farmhouse because it wouldn't make sense. So anyways, I got this truck because like farmhouse vibes, right? It's super cute. It was literally, well, here's the price, $12.99. <laughs> and it has like little flowers. I don't know. It's very fall-esque and just like, it, you could use this year, year around, honestly, in my opinion. Um, and then I got this like bucket. I think it's really cute. I feel like I could totally use this for like a photo shoot, but the vibe is to do like the pumpkin patch, get some like mini pumpkins and like bigger pumpkins and put it outside. 
And then on the inside, oh, it's just my receipt for now, but on the inside, I want to get like some hay. Uh, I think you can get it at the grocery store right now. So like stuff a bunch of hay so that way like the pumpkins could be falling out of it, like mini pumpkins, and then like bigger pumpkins around it. It'll be so cute, like I swear. Once, I don't have the hay in the pumpkins yet, but I want to wait till it gets closer to um, October so the pumpkins don't rot, but like that's the idea. And I had to snatch this, it was so cute. So yes, we got a bucket. <laughs> Um, okay, so onto the bigger bag now. Uh, just like a little, like little stuff because I feel like my house already is very like neutral tone. So like the colors kind of are full esque. Like I have like a yellow blanket on the couch right now and stuff. But anyways, <laughs> Julia, when we were at TJ Maxx, saw this and she was like, "Oh my god, this would be perfect for your bar cart." Because if you guys don't know, I'll show you guys in a little bit when I like put everything everywhere. Um, I have like a little mini bar cart in my house, and it says "More booze, please." And I just feel like, yes, this could be up like again year round, but like, come on, this is really cute, like for like fall, Halloween. I, I love it. Um, okay, what else did we get? It's been about, like only a couple days, and I kind of don't remember everything. Uh, Oh yeah, I got these um, little pumpkins. So these two, oh my gosh, I almost broke. I got these two pumpkins. One's like smaller than the other, barely, but like I wanted to get three different sizes and like different textures and colors. So this is like a wood white pumpkin. And then these two, this is orange. Oh, okay, I'm telling you guys colors, like if you guys don't know colors, just whatever. <laughs> um, orange and brown. And then you guys cannot see what's happening because like I'm, obnoxiously tall so i have to put it a certain way and i punch <laughs> um but like i'm trying to like basically get like different thing going on you see see yeah okay you guys get it anyways i'll show you when i set it up on my table and then i got um new little towels i'm really obsessed with like hand towels i don't know what it is i don't think it's just when you have like, a place of your own the little things make you so happy like i love buying towels and blankets and ugh, don't even get me started on pillows i'm obsessed with like pillows like um decor pillows and stuff like that and just like making my space like very homey um but yeah so i got like new towels they're orange white and black and one says spooky the other one says boo and this one says um happy halloween i i'm a sucker for like little things that like say like what they are and like i don't know i just like really cute sayings okay and the next thing i got Wait, what the heck is this? I don't remember what this is. <laughs> we'll save this for last. Okay, and then I got like a new throw blanket because I love the one I have right now. And they had one very similar, like, but in orange. And it was like $40. And I was like, am I going to spend $40 on a blanket? It was really nice though, but <laughs> I'm cheap, so I'm not doing that. So I found this one. It's really cute. And bye bye. I was like, what? Are you kidding me? And I believe this, yeah, this was only $16.99. So I was like, it's still really cute. It gets like the point around and it's really soft i love soft blankets so we have a new throw i think i'm just gonna leave the yellow one too because it it's fall vibes you know like yellow is fall <laughs> okay and then now this like little wrapping thing Let's see. oh my god yes they're cups and they have skeletons on it and they do different yoga poses and on the inside of the cup it tells you like what the pose name is so like okay so you see this one right it says downward werewolf i thought it was so cute and i drink a matcha every day so i think it'd be really cute to have these out by like okay so i have like a coffee maker but i don't drink coffee i have it for guests and i didn't want to get like a super fancy keurig when i'm never going to use it but they will but i don't have guests every day um so it's just gonna be like as like a vibe like you know it's gonna be my coffee maker whatever <laughs> um yeah so that's that and then the last thing the last thing i got was like a outdoor like place mat are these called place mats feet mats rugs <laughs> outdoor mat i don't know what these are called but look at jack skellington he's he's a vibe so it says welcome to your worst wait what does it say Welcome to your nightmare. Why Why did I totally like make up my own say? It literally says that. Whatever, okay, you guys know where this goes. It's gonna be outside. It's gonna be so cute. Okay, let's let's put it all together so you guys can see like my vision. <laughs> okay, but like, <laughs> this is why I wanted it to decorate for fall slash like Halloween, whatever, fall vibes. It's fall, Halloween happens in fall. Um, is because your girl still has freaking at easter because like do you decorate for summer because like i don't i don't know what that means so i was just like bunnies are for summer so um you're cute and i'll see you next
spring. <laughs> Let's put these up. Okay, so I went with a happy Halloween for the kitchen. These are definitely just for looks. Um, I don't really use the towel that's here. I have like, not special towels, but I have towels over there that's meant to like wash your hands because these are nice. Um, but I have these two and I feel like if I have like two, that might be like weird, right? Because it's just like happy Halloween spooky. But I, I know I want to put one in my bathroom here downstairs. I just don't know which one would look better in the bathroom. I'm thinking this one. Um, so yeah, let's, let's do that. But maybe, I, I guess I'll put this one in like the guest bath. No, maybe I'll just save it and I'll switch them. I don't know. What am I going to do with the third one? What do I do with this? Uh, why am I making like, I'm like stressing out guys. I don't know if, I think I've talked about this already that like my anxiety has been really bad these days. So like the little things I'm like stressing out about. Um, okay. So I just had like a yellow towel and it, this one says wash your hands. I just, I don't know. I love when things tell me to do what they're meant to do. Like that sounds really dumb, but <laughs> I think they're so cute. So I think that'll look cute. Let me see. Let me show you guys. See, yeah, this is really cute. And then this i guess could stay i literally put this here um after christmas because i don't have a lot of space to like store things right now so i was like you know what i don't have any room for you like in storage so you're gonna stay in my bathroom i think i'm just gonna leave it honestly and yeah it's the situation right now you gotta go away <laughs> you know what i decided i'm just gonna layer the towels i think they look cute it's like a little weird but for now it'll do and i think it's kind of it's a vibe it's a vibe so so this is what we have, just like boo spooky, and I just like layered them that way. I don't know. I think it's cute. So yeah, <laughs> it's just a bathroom towel. It's not that big of a deal. <laughs> All right. So next, I'm gonna put like the coffee cups. Um, don't look at my dishes, okay? Like I, I know. Like I said, we're having a little mental health moment. So I'm not up with the cleaning. But yeah. So I have dirty dishes in there. Don't mind that. <laughs> So this is like the like corner in my kitchen right here and I'm trying to be like aesthetic but like obviously I didn't want to spend money on a Keurig when I don't drink coffee. Um, but I have this here because I thought it was cute with like the coffee tea and like well this is sugar. And then yes don't don't look at that. <laughs> These are the towels I use anyways. Um, I'm thinking of maybe placing the skull um, cups there to make it a little festive over here. I think it'd be cute, but I need to like rearrange this because there's not really like a lot, a lot of space, you see? So let's see what I can do. Obviously, I'm going to wash the cups, but for the sake of the video and try to be aesthetic, I'm just placing everything now, but <laughs> yes, I'm going to wash the cups, relax. <laughs> Um, okay, so I think this looks cute enough. I probably will be switching this around throughout the next couple weeks, but this is going to be what it is for now. I don't know if that's weird because it's coffee sugar tea and I'm used to seeing a coffee tea sugar, but it's like really bothering me like right now, <laughs> but that's I think that's how it works. You know, like this is, this is, this is a vibe and the cups are like all black. Like it's aesthetic, bro. Like, ah, I love it. Anyways. Okay. So coffee cups set festive. Woo. <laughs> All right, now here is my bar cart. I'm, this is, I love this so much. <laughs> I don't drink daily. I mean, no, whatever you, you do you, but this is for when like guests come over and it's just like really cute to see. It's very aesthetic, you know, like adulty, like, um, yeah, you know. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just missing. Um, we are gonna put up this now. I really don't know where I wanna put it, although I do need to take the tags off. But I really, I enjoy like going on Pinterest and looking at everybody's ideas on how they decorate their house. But I feel like as much as you can like look up and like try and like be like other people's aesthetics, it's like really hard to do. Like I visually see what they're doing. And then when I go to the store, I'm like, oh, what do I buy? So I don't know, but I'm trying here. I'm trying. Um, I don't know where to put this though. Maybe I'll just like friggin, let me see. That's just like so random. I can't put it there, but Wait, well, this doesn't even supposed to be out, but I had friends over yesterday, so <laughs> okay, let me just like put this away in here. Okay, so I think it needs a little bit more going on but for now that's cute 
so this is like a start of something <laughs> but okay from afar it looks like it says more boobs it's boobs i swear <laughs> Okay, so I, are you, are we crooked? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> okay, so now I have like the truck. This is literally so cute. It even has like a wheel inside. Um, a steering wheel, whatever. Anyways, so we have the truck and we have the three pumpkins. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we have three pumpkins. And at first I was just gonna have them like on my center table that like I'm sitting at right now. Uh this like brown table but i always have like my fruit here and then like coasters and like a candy bowl for all my friends to come which i'm so glad my friends eat my candy because like please i don't need all of it <laughs> um but i feel like that might be like too much going on i'm gonna have to get rid of like the candle and like stuff like that i mean i guess i can move the fruit back over there because that's what i usually do for the holidays when i decorate the tables i move my fruit basket to like the kitchen area i just don't like having my fruit by like the sink because like that's kind of dirty you know what i mean so maybe i'll move the fruit basket like in the middle of this counter but i really like having my like white counter like <laughs> um my island like super clean and nothing on it hence um yes obviously like it's super clean when i have a tripod <laughs> um but you guys get the view like you get you get the idea right i just like have it to be blank but maybe it'll just i don't know i think it might be a better spot for it now so i don't know let, let's try it out <laughs> I decided that I'm gonna keep this inside just because I really like it and I feel like it is too small to go outside so I'm just gonna get like larger pumpkins and maybe something else to decorate the outside but I think this kind of looks really cute for the table for now and then once I get the hay and stuff I can put more pumpkins in there and spread it across the table but this is a good start and I did put the fruit basket over there I don't know how I like it but for now y'all gonna it's gonna stay there and then so I just kind of like move things around on the table I think it's really cute i love this table too it's oh, my favorite but i don't really use it often so i should use it more <laughs> um yeah so we have my um coasters still which i don't know i love these coasters so cute <laughs> um the pumpkins i did the white and the orange like i felt like it was very contrasty and then um i did the basket obviously which will be filled like i said and then like the brown one over here so it like balances out so we don't have the two and two pumpkins i did end up putting this candle which i actually got for christmas it's a cinnamon apple warm spice converting candle but i think that is still like a fall scent i actually ended up buying this candle just because it was red and i needed a green and red candle um but yeah fall vibes woo and then i put the truck here at the end i feel like it's really cute right tell me what you think good obviously it looks a little bit not so cute because it's not like the middle part doesn't have anything coming out of it but just imagine that okay <laughs> I will update you guys on like my house as fall comes around more and like there's more decor that I find that I like, but you know, we can't just spend all our money at once. We need to save. <laughs> okay, so, and then I added this, like, cute little thing that I had from last year. I did, like, a photo shoot with um, little trick-or-treat baskets. So, I still have them. And I actually got these off of Amazon. It was, like, a pack of two for, like, $10 or something like that. Um, I just put, like, candy here. And I originally had, like, all of the, like, the pink flower and then, like, one of the candles over here with my Polaroid. But for now, I just put it at the bottom. And then, like, the candle I moved over here. So I think that's kind of cute. Very Halloween-y. Um, <laughs> Halloween-y. <laughs> I don't know why that was funny um yeah we have like my switch and this is actually a record player um but i think it looks really cute like just here and i needed this to be held up somewhere um my records which is literally just two ariana grande ones but i really want to get more so any um advice to get the vinyls let me know um and then the touch of like pink to balance this out which yeah okay it's coming along it's cute there's a schmoof eating his chicken wing <laughs> so now i have to do the couch um this blanket is not supposed to be here it's very not aesthetic but um i was laying on here and my friend slept over and yeah okay anyways so i think the white blanket will stay and the yellow blanket will stay also i have like this chair here too but 
this is like an inside joke with like family so i have to always keep this here it's really cute um and then the pillows which my cat destroyed it had pom-poms on it but you know whatever so this will stay too because it's a very neutral toned um blanket this one will just be going later but i like to use that when i lay down so honestly i just need to get like a basket to put like blankets in so you could like you know what i mean pull them out when you want it but it doesn't have to be like on display so i need that and i'm also going to get a mirror to put here i already ordered it so it'll be coming soon because this wall has been empty for like literally as long as i've lived here because i because mirrors are expensive and to get like a big ass mirror like I mean, you guys know, okay, I guess the glass is expensive, which makes the mirror expensive. So I'm like spending like $400 on a mirror. Like I'm gonna go broke off of just spending it on that. Also, please don't mind how tired I look at this like outro at that second half of this video. I'm very tired. Like I said last night, I had friends over and let's just say I didn't go to bed till like 4 a.m. And then I woke up at like nine, which I don't know why. My body just like wakes up. So like, I'm very tired. So, excuse the mess. <laughs> um, so let me just like put the blanket out. I think we only have the blanket and the like the um, the mat. What is it called? Oh my god, I have bags, bro. It's so bad. I need to get some rest tonight, <laughs> guys. Please don't judge me. I don't always look like this. Um, I need to put the doormat. Okay, but let's put the blanket. I think it's gonna be really cute. It's so fuzzy. I love it. I love fuzzy blankets. And I'm like a homebody person. Like, I love to just stay home. So, yeah. <laughs> Okay, and I was originally going to get some fall pillows, but I didn't like any of them at TJ Maxx. So, for now, we have this one. This is my, like, the one that's here, like, literally all the time. So, oh, you like the smell of the blankie? You gotta get your scent on it already, huh? So, I don't know if I... I like to, like, throw the pillows on... I mean, throw the blankets on the pillow. I think it's cute. But I don't know if I should just, like, throw this one. Oh, wait, that was, like, aesthetic. You know what? That was good enough. I'm gonna leave it like that for now. I know it's like three things going on. Maybe I'll just... It's fine, you know what? The blink is gonna go there. I'm gonna go sit on my couch after I film this, so... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, now... Now what? All right, last but not least is this mat, which I love this so much. Oh, hello, because I feel like that's what I say, and it's just like very like Kaylee, um, but we're gonna replace it with this. So here we go. <laughs> Ta -da! Oh my god, it's so cute! I love it! Ah! Okay, so I ended up putting like this, my my mat, the other mat, the one that I just said oh hell that I had in the front, um, in the back of my house because I do have like a back door and I feel like I go through a lot of the back door because I park my car in my garage, everything's back here, you know, my backyard. So, yeah, <laughs> that's where this one went. Like, you guys really cared much. But anyways, I just thought I'd share that. Wow, this lighting is really nice. Makes me look less tired. <laughs> Bro, no. Thank you. <laughs> you want to do the outro with me? You need to calm down, though. All right. So that's pretty much it for this video. I am still gonna be getting some fall decor because I feel like it was kind of little, but yeah. Anyways, that's that's all we got for this video. I'm so tired. I can't I can't form sentences right now. Um, but I think it's, it's cute. It's giving vibes. He loves the blanket. He's a huge fan. He also did ruin my yellow blanket because he has anxiety like me. He's supposed to be my emotional support dog, my therapy dog, my yeah I, I guess that's what they're called right um and he does his job for the most part but i feel like when he gets anxiety he chews on things which is i guess like me because when i get anxiety i this is probably really gross but like i bite like my skin on my nails and i like pick them and stuff and oh, that's why they're so short right now but i finally got them done Makes me happy when I get my nails done. Ah. <laughs> um, yeah, so he like chewed holes in my knitted blanket, which is fine, I guess, even though he has like 600 toys, which I also need to go through. But anyways, yeah, that's kind of it for this video. Um, more decor coming soon. I'll up you, I'll up you guys. <laughs> I'll update you guys on what I get. 
um some thoughts for videos this upcoming fall i'm like so excited for them i have a lot actually um that i still need to post but i think as this video is up hey please do not do that felicity so rude my stuff is always ruined because of my cats um what was i gonna say <sighs> Oh yeah, the exciting like videos and stuff. Um, but you guys probably have already heard as I think I've already posted before this video is up. But um, wow, I cannot keep my train of thought. Um, my like software program thingy, I don't know what it's called. I don't know proper terms. Um, where I edit my videos, like something happened and it glitched. I'm like so frustrated with that because I couldn't figure it out. So luckily I had somebody help me. So um, I have like a lot of videos I still need to post and I'm just like wondering like should I post three times a week now? Cause I think I'm finally getting my, my shit together and I'm like, okay, let's just post three times a week. Cause that's like has been my goal is to post three times a week consistently like um, yeah, there's not much to it. I just, that's my goal is to do that for you guys. And it makes me so happy to like see that you guys like my videos and just because I, I, I just feel like creating um, YouTube videos makes me really happy and I get to connect with you guys more and you guys can see like what I do in a day, which honestly is not really a lot because if I'm going to be honest with you guys, like I have social anxiety. I don't like hanging out with a lot of people. It stresses me out. Okay, but don't get me wrong. That makes it sound like I don't like people. I love socializing. It just like when it's a big group, it's... it's you guys know if you guys have social anxiety if you know anybody who has that like we love hanging out with you guys But then I also need to just like be alone and I feel like with YouTube videos I can still be with you guys, but not get like so stressed out. I hope that makes sense because I do love hanging out with everybody It's just like Yeah, okay. Let's not ever explain that I definitely want to make a video of like my mental health and stuff like that I just get like very anxious because I'm like it's kind of personal I've never really shared that before other than just saying I have anxiety but yeah, I definitely would love to share more about mental health because I think it's very important to me and explain to you guys how it works being a social media influencer slash like model and having like anxiety like pretty bad and just like how I, how I deal with it and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm, I'm definitely gonna do that series. I have that in the works already. I have it set to be um, shot. I don't know by this video, maybe I've shot it already and I just haven't uploaded. But yeah, we're gonna be doing something for mental health and then we're gonna be doing, of course, like cosplay and like trying on costumes. I already have that in, in the works too, but we're gonna save to post that closer to like October. Um, pumpkin carving oh my gosh there's so much there's so much gonna be happening i don't know why i'm spoiling this for you guys but you guys don't know the details or whatever <laughs> anyways thank you so much for watching this video and supporting me i love you guys so much don't forget to follow me on my other platforms my instagram that's spencer my instagram <laughs> he's still there my tiktok my twitter and uh, y'all know the rest. I wish I could wink, wink, wink. <laughs> That's my wink. That's me blinking. Um, don't forget to click the link in the description box as well as in my bio or the link on my Instagram bio. It has all of my platforms. Ooh, so don't forget to follow me on all my platforms. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye, guys.